and welcome back to part two of my rainbow themed December 2022 project life kit. Oh, wow. Last video I posted was like 30 minutes long of me rambling and uh, <clears throat> my throat is feeling it. So this is essentially what I'm working with. So as I said in the previous video, uh, what I did was I dug through my embellishments, which I already store in rainbow color order, and I pulled basically what I thought would be most useful and threw it in this little kit. So I would go through the little four by, actually here, I'll grab it for you so you can actually see. These are my embellishments. They're a mixture of handmade, bought, gifted, die cut. It's just a bit of everything. Um, and on the right side are the colors that I use most often. And on the left are the colors I use less frequently. And I've got two mixed here. So I pulled these little, these little four by six containers out and I would kind of sift through them and pull out the things that I thought I would be more likely to use. I'm actually going to take this out too. That'd be a good Valentine's Day one. Um, and then I'm, as I'm trying to stay away from dimensional things in my album this year, I, I would leave things like this in here. And of course, if there's something very specific I'm looking for, I know where to go looking. So that is where things started. And so in going through all of those little containers, I pulled out... I don't really know if I'm going to use ribbon. I'll leave it in there. It's fine. But I'd pull out labels and um, cardboard, chipboard things and kind of group them in this little iris container by color. So red, orange, pink, yellow. Um, this was stars. I use a lot of stars and hearts. Uh, my purple. My purple is sad. <laughs> I'm okay with it. Um... This was, oh, Paige, was it Paige Evans? Turn the page. There was a collection kit. So I had a six by six paper pad and there was only one sheet of paper left in it and it had all these little speech bubbly kind of things in it. So I just cut those out. I fussy cut them. My teal and blue is a little bit more substantial. Yellow, not huge. Green, not huge. I actually... Um, used a lot of my greens in my December daily this year. So that's a good thing. Neutrals, grays, whites. And then this was kind of the things that were either multicolor or really didn't fit anywhere else. Um, so this would be from this same collection, actually. Um, little butterflies and stuff that I cut out. Uh, little handmade embellishments that were gifted to me. Stickers. More little chipboard things. So it's just totally random. Oh, that's not going to stay in there. That's too chunky. So yeah, that's kind of that little section. And then this section is um, words. I think it's mostly words and maybe black and white. Have to look. Um, this just didn't fit anywhere else. Some washi that's been in my stash. More washi some little um, notes that came in my citrus twist kits. These are some stickers. I likely won't use them, but I thought I would throw them in here just to try to use them. Um, some leftover um, letter stickers that I turned into titles. Some leftover wood veneer. Oh, that's something I don't have in here yet. I'm gonna need to go get wood veneer. Well, snap. Um, and some like clear stickers that I mounted on white cardstock to kind of add to things. Uh, what else is in this section? Yeah, like more clear stick, And then like things like this. I think this was me and my big ideas. Yeah. And then I've got, I love these hearts. Aren't they awesome? These are from Illustrated Faith. Um, and I'm pretty sure they've got them in every single color, which is amazing. So I'm going to go get rid of that. 
I threw in some Studio Calico. I think I'm going to leave the wood vin... Mm. No, I'm going to go grab my wood veneer container. If there's anything that has words, it's going to go in the kit. I'll be back. Thankfully, I don't have a lot of wood veneer, but I totally forgot about this container. Man. Arrows. What else? Sift. Cameras. Those are cute. Little pork parts. I think they're all clouds. Yeah. So maybe I should make a section just for cork. Cork and veneer. I don't think I actually have many little wood veneers in here that have words on them anymore. I think they were probably the first things I used. These cork are actually DIY cork, so they're really rough. Um, I will probably just end up throwing those out, to be honest. They didn't turn out as well as I had hoped. The thing about a lot of the wood veneer that's in here is it's a little thick be fun for like a road trip. Arrows, always useful. And these are really thin arrows too. They're like tiny. Let's see if we can use those up. I don't actually see a lot in here that have words, surprisingly. I wonder if they found their way someplace else. I must go look. Be right back. Now I'm curious. So I pulled all of my little trays that have goodies and things, and I think I've got only one more tray left. I'm trying to consolidate. All of these things is actually really tricky. Um, I actually have some stickers. Oh, those will go in there for sure. this at the dollar store and there's some alphas in here that I hate but the rest of it's not bad and I feel like the Jen Hadfield pad might although these colors are a little bit more muted might not be quite the right fit I should grab my Maggie Holmes pad We're on a very rambly journey today, folks. Very rambly journey. Um, do I keep those in there? I might be able to use a few of them, but I feel like the colors are just a tad bit subdued. Wow, so many things. I'm finding more alphas as I'm digging. I actually picked these up at the dollar store too, and I, I rather like them. I obviously, I picked this one because it's coffee. I enjoy gardening, so I thought that would be kind of fun. Maybe I'll just leave these kind of to the side. I know that they're here, so that might just be enough because I feel like if I put too much more in here, it's not even going to close. And like I said, a lot of this stuff is stuff that's just, it's in my stash and I know it's there for the most part. I might just cut out the sheets that I know I'm going to use and toss these other ones because these alphas are yikes. All right, enough 
rambling. I'm going to stop this video because it is quickly spiraling into insanity. But um, basically, my plan is to start almost right away. Um, I have a couple of plans for some layouts um, already. And I'm hoping to start my weekly documenting pretty much every Sunday. Um, and then that'll give me the whole week to take the pictures that I feel like I want to following the plan that I came up with. If you're not sure, check back last video. I showed you like my plan. So that's it for today. And uh, thanks for coming and hanging out with me during my crazily, crazy rambling session. And uh, I will see you next video. Bye for now. Oh, and don't forget to dig out your rainbow embellishments if you want to play along with me. Bye for now.